Eleanor Roosevelt once said, I think at a child's birth, if a mother could ask a fairy godmother to endow it with the most useful gift, that gift would be curiosity. What Eleanor captures so eloquently is the idea that curiosity and happiness are deeply connected. Curious people see life as a mystery to be explored. They bounce back from life's everyday trials, knowing that every challenge is an opportunity to grow and learn. The sparkle in their eyes is a reflection of the happiness in their souls. We are born curious. As children, we love to explore. We ask questions and demand answers. As we explore, our experiences shape our understanding of the world. We want to know more about everything. Watching a child at play will quickly show you that being curious is a fundamental part of the human experience. Sadly, as we grow older, it's easy to lose our curiosity. Reality begins to weigh heavily on our shoulders, and we move from asking why to asking what and how. Let's explore how we can rediscover the curiosity that we naturally had as children. Let's get curious about the amazing secrets that are all around us, secrets that are waiting to be investigated and solved. Curiosity is more than a commitment to learning. It is also more than the willingness to take risks and have one's beliefs challenged. Curiosity is a way of looking at the world. It forces our thoughts outward into the world. And when we view the world through curious eyes, we see the machinery of the universe working around us. Over time, curiosity teaches us to see events in the larger context. And as we gain perspective, we become happier. The world around you is like a magnificent library filled with fascinating stories and useful information. Are you ready to explore? Are you curious about what your life would look like if you could see the world through your childlike eyes? Close your eyes for a moment and try to remember what it was like to be a curious child. Try to remember the smile that appeared on your face with every new experience. Of course, being curious as a child is relatively easy. But as adults, our lives are often filled with complexity, worry, and fear. How can we bring curiosity back into our lives as adults while maintaining a realistic perspective on the world? Sometimes it helps to start with a simple question. What are you most curious about? Is there a skill or hobby that you love? Is there a new talent that you've always wanted to develop and explore but have never found the time? Is there a country or a city that you've always wanted to find out more about? What are you curious about? Now hold that thought as we continue. How does it feel when you're curious? Learning to pay attention to the early signs of curiosity in our lives is an important skill. Most of us have moments every day when we're curious. Unfortunately, these moments are far too easily smothered by the persistent clutter of everyday concerns. The next time you feel yourself getting curious, stop and pause. Give yourself permission to stop for a moment and daydream. If you don't have time to act on your curiosity at that moment, write down your questions and come back to them. Ironically, when you take the time to be curious, you starve your worries of oxygen. Taking an interest in the outside world allows us to transcend our everyday concerns. It allows us to think on a macro level instead of staying focused on the specific. And with a wider lens through which to view the world, it is easier to put our problems in perspective. Anxiety often comes from a sense that we cannot influence our environment. The best way to take control of your world is to see yourself as an explorer with your hands firmly on the wheel. With a curious mind, you are an active participant, not a passive observer. Do you see yourself as the architect of your own life? Of course, not being worried is not the same as being positive. So, why are curious people happier? 
Positivity is a direct consequence of curiosity. Curiosity creates a sense of hopefulness and supports the feeling that something wonderful is about to happen. Every day is an opportunity to learn about ourselves and the world around us. Life is not something that happens to us. It's an adventure story in which we are playing the lead role. Of course, like any great story, life has its share of unexpected outcomes. So we must learn to be comfortable with change. The good news is that even change can be a source of positivity. Every challenge is a mystery to be solved. Every plot twist, good and bad, is an opportunity to learn and explore. Curiosity gives us perspective and helps us to honor every revelation. Every new piece of information becomes a part of who we are. Curiosity is a powerful tool for anti-aging in the most positive sense of the term. Not only does it help us take an active role in shaping our future, but it also helps us to stay young. Curiosity helps us to learn new things, be open-minded, open up to new experiences and adventures. Nurture the flame of your own curiosity it will guide you to places, ideas, and thoughts. Personal growth is a gift for baby boomers, and there is no progress without curiosity. Let's get out there together and live with positivity and verve. Let's ask questions, listen actively, and see the world as a wondrous gift to be explored. Let's help each other to be inventors, explorers, and navigators the captains of our own ships. If we are curious about what's going on around the next corner, we will be far more willing to embrace it when we find it. Let curiosity lift us higher to a more positive future. Call to action. Write down one thing that you want to learn more about today. Finish the sentence. I am really curious to find out... Then go research, ask questions, find answers, ask more questions. Write down how you feel after you've explored your area of interest. You may not have discovered the definitive answer, but you're on the journey. Make a lasting change. Pick one new thing to learn every day. It can be a big or small question, important or insignificant. The important thing is to make it your mission to be a curious person. Write down your daily question and keep going with your commitment to become a lifelong learner.